short track Saturday night. And I tell you, we got the we got all the main guys right up at the front right now. You got 188807. You got Mark in fifth. Truex. You got Tony seventh. You got Jeff Gordon. I eighth. believe Junior's got the best car right now. I really do. He is. Uh, he's really getting off the corner. Watch him drag up off the corner here and make the pass. And Kyle Busch is running the bottom, but Junior keeps it wound up just enough that Kyle Busch can't get by him down the straightaway. You'll see it right here. Kyle Busch will go to the bottom, but look at what happens off turn two. Junior gets the run on the high side. The front stretch, stay away from the wall if you can, look at it. Right front looked a little soft, maybe a chill. Look right thing. here, though. Whoa. Way wide off turn two. That can't work. But it did. <laughs> and Dale Earnhardt Jr. comes out with a lead. They'll be coming to 17 laps to go. That's the way to do it, baby. That's the way to do it. Come on. Stay focused. 17 that to go. You're the man. was come a power get move. Get it. It's there. Coming to 10 to go. Dale Earnhardt Jr. in this 88 car. He has checked out to almost a second lead over Kyle Busch in that 18. Good to go, man. Nice and smooth. Turn three and four, he just and, lost it. And, and he it can't couldn't get happen to the at pits. a worse place because can't he's not going to make road. it around. That'll be, he'll draw the caution sitting there. He didn't need a caution. Junior didn't need a caution. There's the caution. Bad news gets worse for Hamlin for stopping on track to draw the caution. NASCAR is going to park him for two laps. Five to go. Green flag. Oh, the 18 spun. He spun the tires. Big, big time. And that lets the 07 Clint Boyer pull right up there. And there goes Mark Martin in that Army car. Going to get interesting. Junior went up the hill pretty high, but I think that's his line. Kyle Busch got a great run off turn two down the back straightaway. You know he'll pack it down into turn three. Oh, he's boogieing down in there, baby. But he's... will it stick? And Junior gives him the bottom. Junebug's, Car washes up. Junebug's got that high line. He wants to run it, but I tell you, that 18 is going to get under him right here. Three to go. Here he goes. Junior goes up the hill. Let's see if he can get a bite on the bottom of the racetrack. They'll be side by side down the back straightaway. Oh, man, that was tight off turn two. He's got him. Oh, I believe he's got him this time. Oh, he turned him. No. Oh, he turned him. Oh, no. no. No, no. Now, here comes Clint Boyer to take the yellow flag. Oh, no. Something. That ain't going to go over too good right oh, there. No, it's not. I love the little old boy to death, but that was not a good move right there. You just see him. He just gets in there a little too hard. And, of course, Junior's not cutting him any slack. He's keeping him pinned down, but can't run over the man. This was going down the back straightaway. They're neck and neck halfway down the back stretch. And you see Junior kind of roll out, but the, the 18 just gets up the hill a little too much and gets into him. And there just wasn't enough racetrack between them. I think Ooh. he's just there and there's nothing, you know, it's just not, it doesn't work. You know what, Daryl, what I did not like, what I saw, I saw the wheels on the 18 car turn to the right just ever so slightly. I probably could have moved down a little bit lower getting into the corner. He probably could have moved up higher. I mean, it's just a product of good hard race. And I apologize to those guys, you know. Uh, it, it's tough that uh, they had a great race car tonight, and they probably could have finished, uh, if not winning the race, probably second. But Rick Pigeon coming on down here was uh, was a friend of mine and has always been a great friend of Dale Jr. That was a little uncalled for, and it's not all about him all the time, so uh, he'll know what I mean by that. Dale Jr., was that a fair racing move, or does Kyle Busch need some extra security leaving Richmond tonight? Whether it's fair or not, he's going to need some security. The worst part about it is, is just I've been priding myself on running good all, week, all year, and... I was in position for a win, and uh, I ran hard and got wrecked.